Hey guys, welcome to your love reading. The person that is on your mind for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for February 2022. We're going to take a look at the person that's currently on your mind, uh, see what their current over energies are like, what they are up to, uh, what their true feelings are towards you, and then we'll finish off the read to see if they're going to take any future action towards you, okay? Uh, or what future actions they will take towards you. So this could be someone that you are currently dealing with or someone that you're separated from, that you're not speaking to, there's no contact. Uh, so feel free to apply this to your own unique situation, switch the rules if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates, leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate, take a look at your other placements. Uh, if you guys haven't done so yet, hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. Give this video a thumbs up. Like this video so that this message can circulate around to the individuals that need to hear this. Share this video with someone if you feel like there's someone out there that you know that needs to hear this. Leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates. Uh, for those of you guys that are interested in booking a private personal reading with me, the link is in the description box below. All right, Virgo, let's get started. Um, tell me about the person that is currently on Virgo's mind. What are their over energies? What are they up to? What are their true feelings towards Virgo? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signed for February 2022. Okay, Justice in the Reverse, Four Cups, Libra Energy, could be dealing with a Libra here. You might have Libra on your chart. Uh, Virgo Energy, Pre-Empress Energy, Queen of Wands, okay? Aries, Leo, Sag, Eight of Wands, and the Six of Swords. You know... I mean, this could be you over here, but it seems like there's a situation where someone here doesn't want anything to do with somebody, okay? Someone here is loving their freedom. Someone here is loving their independence. Uh, someone here could be traveling a lot or that they're, this is the energy of moving on but with the Eight of Wands and the Six of Swords here, okay? Let's see. Justice in the reverse. The High Priestess, Cancer, Pisces energy. You know, I feel like this individual is right now, there's this like inner knowing that, you know, this is not going to work, I feel. Uh, four of Cups. Look at the Knight of Cups here. You know, if this person is approaching you or has approached you, you have rejected, you have rejected this person. Uh, you know, I feel like maybe this person is coming in pretending like, you know, nothing happened. They're not taking responsibility for their actions. They might be just apologizing for the sake of apologizing here. Uh, the Nine of Pentacles. King of Wands. We have a true pair here, by the way, okay? So I feel like the person that, you know, maybe did you a bit dirty here is this King of Wands, okay? Uh, Queen of Wands. Two of Pentacles. This person might be juggling you between two different people here. Uh, perhaps, you know, you know, perhaps there is pre empress here, okay? And, you know, this Queen of Wands could be the other person. This King of Wands is dealing with this Queen of Wands too. Uh, there is a true pair here, a soul tie here. So I feel like this person might be juggling you for, like, sex or something like that. Eight of Wands. Queen of Cups. Who is this King talking to? There's a few feminine energies here. Six of Swords. Ace of Wands. Okay, so this Queen of Cups could be you right here, Virgo. Uh, you're this pre empress and this Queen of Cups. It seems like this Queen is just moving on, moving along, focusing on their passions here, focusing on their business or something like that. Six of Cups. Yeah, you're definitely releasing an X here. The thing is, I feel like this ex that you're dealing with here was involved or is involved with someone else, is in another, is in another commitment with someone else here, okay? 
All right. A person that is on Virgo mind, will they take any sort of action, future actions towards Virgo? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for February 2022. 2022. <clears throat> okay. Someone is hopeful here that you will accept their cup or their apology, but I feel like with the star card in the reverse, that's a huge no-no. I feel like, you know, you know, you could be in this energy of like, you know, there's no hope in this connection here. You don't want to rebuild this again. You know, you're going to let this tower stay down because, you know, this is a toxic situation that you don't no longer want to be caught in here. We have the Fool and the Two of Cups. So this is you not wanting anything to do with this connection here or this love triangle because it seems like there is three people here, okay? Uh, you know, you could, you could be off on your own. Like I said, you could be focusing on you, you know, loving your freedom, loving your independence here. I mean, it seems like this person is coming back for some sexy time here, okay? I feel like this person is trying to be flirty at the same time, trying to be sweet, uh, but they, they are dealing with somebody else. Uh, page of Cups. Ace of Wands in the reverse. Yeah, I just feel like you, you just don't want anything to do with this person. You don't want their apology. I can hear you saying that you could take that sh apology and shove it or something like that. Uh, the Star. We have the Hierophant in the reverse. I just feel like, you know, this is... I feel like you know that this is just not the right thing to do speaking to them, especially if they're involved with somebody else. The tower in the reverse. The knight of swords. I mean, this person is definitely trying to rush back in, okay? Uh, this is something that you don't want to rebuild with this person here. Libra, Tor uh, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, Taurus, Energy, uh, Aquarius, Energy, Aries, Scorpio, Capricorn, A Aries, Aquarius, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Aries, Leo, Sag, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, uh, Virgo. Could be dealing with any of those energies. You might have those energies in your chart. The Devil. Six of Wands. I feel like you feel like there could, there's nothing good that could come of the situation. Okay? Uh, the Fool. Six of Pentacles. Yeah, you're definitely not giving to this. You are definitely not giving to this. Two of Cups. Ace of Cups. Yeah, you no longer love this person anymore. Uh, you're just tired of, you know, be, being this person's doormat. Okay? Could be a twin flame connection here. You know, you just don't want to be disappointed again. You just want to move on from this. So, yeah, I, I just see you definitely moving on from this and not entertaining this person. Uh, because, like I said, this person is involved uh, in another connection here. Okay? So, Virgo, I hope this was helpful. I hope this resonated. If it was, uh, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video. Like this video if you haven't done so yet. Uh, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I will speak to you guys in the next one. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.